welcome back to my channel i hope all of you are having an amazing day and i hope you liked my uh, last video of the govan uh, shakudi so today i have something uh, amazing as well for you guys it's the govan stew i hope all of you uh, guys like this video and uh, if you would like to see the recipe continue watching okay guys so first we have to start by uh, cleaning the meat and uh, dicing it so make sure that you dice it like fine uh, let me just show you guys so this is how we need it to be make sure you do not cut it uh, more bigger than this so guys these are all the ingredients that we would require to prepare the stew uh, so i have um, half a kg of beef half a kg of pork for my non-christian friends if you would like to substitute this for chicken you can do that as well so i have about uh, one cup of uh, green peas this is uh, 200 uh, grams of uh, macaroni uh, some salt for seasoning. I have uh, marinated my uh, beef and pork with the salt already and uh, then I require uh, four uh, potatoes, two tomatoes, two carrots, three onions and uh, we need, uh, need butter as well. This is very important. So um, you would require about uh, three to four tablespoons of butter. Uh, we require about uh, two and a half inch of cinnamon stick. Uh, then these are about four Maggi cubes, 45, 45 to, yeah, I say 45 uh, peppercorns and about uh, 15 cloves. And uh, we would also require some ginger garlic paste as well. Okay guys, so now I'm gonna boil the macaroni. So you have to bring the water to a boil, add some salt. This is about uh, one uh, tablespoon of salt. Then add your uh, macaroni. And then after this, you need to add a bit of uh, oil, I would say, so about uh, one uh, tablespoon of oil and just uh, mix it and keep this for about uh, five minutes, I would say. Just check in between because sometimes it cooks earlier as well. So here you can see that I've uh, diced my potatoes and carrots and uh, so what you have to do next is uh, just boil them separately uh, and make sure that you do not uh, throw the stock out because we would need it uh, eventually in this stage. So let me start by uh, adding the potatoes now. And in this you need to add uh, about uh, I would say half a, a teaspoon of uh, salt and uh, just keep them for boiling until make sure that you do not uh, over boil them as well it doesn't have to be too so what we need to do next is we need to uh, rinse the macaroni with some cold water in order to stop the uh, cooking process and then add a little bit of oil about uh, one tablespoon of oil and just leave it aside so guys you can see i've boiled all my ingredients here that's the macaroni then that's the pork my carrots potatoes and the beef and this is the stock which i have kept aside so we do not require a lot of stock i would say about uh, four to five tablespoons of uh, stock and now we have to get started with the recipe so i've heated up a pot here so what we need to do is add uh, about two tablespoons of oil And then what we have to do is add about uh, four uh, tablespoons of butter. So now you can see that my butter has melted. In this pot we need to add in, uh, all the dry ingredients. And just let it saute for about uh, a minute. It's been a minute since my uh, dry ingredients have been roasting here. So now what we have to do is add the onion. So what we have to do is not let the onions brown. You just have to uh, keep it until uh, they turn a bit soft. And then you have to add the tomato. So the onions have been uh, sauteing for about uh, two, one minute I would say. And at this stage you have to add the tomatoes. let this cook for about uh, two or three minutes so my tomatoes have been sauteed well and at this stage we need to add the magic cubes 
stir it just for about uh, 30 seconds and uh, at this stage now we need to add the green peas so my green peas uh, have been sauteed for about a minute at this stage you need to add the pork and the beef So that's the pork and then the beef. Mix it well. So guys, you can see that I mixed my pork and beef uh, quite well. So at, now what we need to do is uh, close the lid and uh, keep this for about uh, two minutes. Uh, and uh, make sure that you reduce your uh, flame to uh, a low and yeah, just leave it on there. So guys, it, it was about two or three minutes that I kept the lid on and now I've increased my flame to uh, medium. At this stage, I'm going to add the macaroni. Yeah, so once you add the macaroni, mix it well. Make sure that you stir it from the bottom because you do not want it to be stuck to the pan. So I've mixed everything well together and now we have to add the potatoes and the carrots as well. Yeah. And then uh, mix it well again and just leave it for about a minute. But keep continuously stirring because you do not want it to be get uh, to get stuck to the bottom of the Guys, I've mixed everything well together and uh, what you need to do now, if your uh, stew is a bit dry, you can add your stock accordingly. Mine is not that dry. Uh, so I'm going to add about uh, two to three tablespoons of the vegetable stock which we had kept aside. Okay, that's it. And then I'm going to mix it well. Okay guys, so the recipe is ready. I hope you guys enjoy it and uh, just have a look at it. It looks so amazing and vibrant. So guys, I've plated the recipe for y'all. I'm serving it with some uh, Goan Pao. It goes well with the uh, pulao rice. I prefer pao, so I have plated it here with pao. And uh, if you guys uh, have liked this uh, recipe, please do not forget to uh, like and comment. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe. And until then, ciao!